Hello everyone, welcome to my channel where AI is a passion, not just a buzzword. Today, I'm excited to show you some cool new AI tools. These tools can take your selfie and transform it into a creative character. You just choose what type of character you want, like a superhero or a fantasy warrior, then the AI work its magic, turning your photo into this character while still keeping it looking like you. Before we dive in, let's see if the images generated by these tools really capture my likeness. Are they close enough to reflect the real me? Now that you've seen how good they are, it's time to get into the actual demo of these tools. I've tested two great solutions for you, but one of them definitely stands out. First up, we've got Photomaker. For the purpose of this video, I'm trying out the stylized version. What is great about it is the variety of artistic styles you can choose from, each giving a unique twist to your photo. Let's take a look at how it's transformed my selfie into something truly artistic. So here we have a Photomaker website. You can find here a gallery of really nice creations and of course some information about local installation if you would like to run it locally. But we will head over to the link with uh, actual demo. I will choose one demo from uh, these links. I will use this one because I already tested that this one is working well for me. So here we have a demo site of Photomaker style, so stylized uh, version. I already added here uh, my photo. Here comes the prompt. I will use already made prompt here. So I will just put it here and change it to man. A photo of a man IMG. So this is very important just to put this uh, keyword. Without this, it's not going to work. And here you have a plethora of uh, styles you would like to choose. Let's use uh, Neopunk. A negative prompt, I will leave it as is. Uh, basically, this is what you don't want to see uh, in the picture and a few extra values um, just to play with if you would like to uh, get a different result. But I will leave it as it is. So let's click Run. And here we have a final result. It is interesting, but um, mm, I'm not sure if it's similar to me. Maybe a little bit. Maybe let's try a different style, maybe comic book. Comic book and run. Here is comic book version. Still good, but um, I don't see too many similarities uh, with myself. Maybe you can find this, but for me it's kind of a bit far from what I would like to achieve here. But the good news is that another program gives much better results. So what now? The second solution, in my opinion, is much better. It just needs one photo and creates something outstanding from it. Let's test Instant ID. Here is main website of Instant ID. But before we jump into the demo, let's check this comparison. So to set properly expectations, see what uh, this program is capable of. It can even use two faces and combine them into really amazing art. Look here, how good it is with Elon Musk, for example, style one, two and three, or with Sam Altman. <laughs> you can see that his face is still preserved. Let's try the actual demo. Again, I will use my photo. So my photo is not very good. I mean, my face, it's not taking uh, 50, 60% of the image, which would be better. But anyway, here is a prompt, a photo of a person. So let's put it a photo of the man wearing Spider-Man suit. And style template, uh, I will choose vibrant color. I'm not going to change uh, the other values, just to make it simple and quick. Submit. And guys, look how cool is that. It preserved my face. So it is quite similar and I'm wearing this uh, Spider-Man suit. It's amazing how good the quality is of uh, this photo. But don't believe me, let's try uh, another style. Maybe let's use some watercolor. Watercolor, but I will delete just wearing Spider-Man suit and I will leave a simple prompt, a photo of the man. Submit. So guys, and what do you think? It's much better than the photo maker. Isn't it? I really, really like uh, this one because it always gives me amazing results. Each time I produce a photo out of it, I'm a bit surprised. 
I hope you find these AI tools as exciting and enjoyable as I did. I am particularly impressed with the quality of the result from Instant ID. It's truly remarkable how it brings our fantasies to life. I'm looking forward to reading about your experiences and the creative concepts you envision. And as we wrap up this exciting exploration, remember to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more incredible content coming your way.